Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Game Gent channel, where I'm playing Lays of Fear Inheritance the DLC. Uh, we've just been through the basement, and now we're onwards to upstairs. And I'm just checking here. What, what's in here? Hiding in the cupboard while they fight. Huh. I don't remember that being there. I'm looking all around, I'm looking all around. Please, please help me. It hurts. Oh, it hurts so much. I can't take it anymore. Mm. Yes. Thank you. It's so good to feel that there's still beauty in this world. Okay. Okay, what about... Oh. Oh, that's not ominous or anything. What's behind this door? Oh. Okay. Fun fact, by the way, after... I only realized this after my... Damn flashlight. That's actually a real painting. That's not like a made up painting. That's actually a real painting of someone. Which is kind of depressing that you think about it. Because it is a very weird painting. Last will and testament. I, blank, grasping at the remains of my sanity, declare this to be my last will and testament. I hereby deem all my precious wills just as worth as such shallow house calling themselves my friends and associates. To my agent, Thomas Coldwell, I bestow. Bestow the hellish vermin that infest my home, praying that they will gnaw away at him endlessly, bleeding him dry just like he did to me. To my publisher, Liam Brickstone, I bequeath the flames that consume the love of my life, in hope that they will devour him along with the wretched whore and squealing bastard he calls his family. To my lawyer, James Jerome Sadler, I pass on whatever illness has rotted my mind and soul away so that he can feel just as empty and useless as he, has, he was to me. And to any other parasites that come crawling out of the work, I leave nothing. To hell with all of you. Finally, to my beloved daughter. I leave all my earthly possessions for what they're worth. I hope they will inspire you to realize your true potential. The final, most precious gift, however, is not mine to give. You will have to discover that on your own. I believe in you as I always have. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh. I have a feeling it's making me pick which side I'm going to go on. Uh, I'm going to go with... Do I follow in Mother's footsteps or Dad's footsteps? Mummy. I presume that's right. Oh, there's two doors. Okay, let's go with Mum. Oh, 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 okay. This angle is not weird at all. Please don't jump scare. Don't hey jump there. Scare. Oh, come oh. on. Don't be afraid. It won't bite. Here. Try for yourself. No, no. That, that's not quite right. Huh. Still not quite there. I'm trying, mommy. I'm only little. Whoever's pounding oh. on that piano, what? Quit it. crayons where are they where are my crowns 
they in here? No, they're in here. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now what? Oh, okay. Yay! Runs in the family. Yay! Everyone's happy. Everyone's happy. <laughs> Naughty dog. I don't like this this fish eye angle, low angle. Like I know I'm supposed to be the kid, but it's fucking creepy. Oh, Mummy's wheelchair. It's very dark as well. Oh, that's not. Oh. Okay. Ah, so his side has moved on a little bit. So do it's like, do I continue? Do I try and balance? I'll try and balance it out. Oh, oh, okay. I, th I think I regret my decision. Immediately. <laughs> okay. What's in here? Painting, sleeping, painting, hiding, painting, crying, crying, painting. Okay. I picked mummy. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay. Um, oh sh Oh god. Oh god. Okay. So what happened to the daughter? Because I'm still not quite sure what happened. I can't... Hmm. Oh. What the fuck was that? Oh god, this is so disorientating. It's down here. Don't think I wanted to go down. Oh, is it... No, no. There we go. Huh. 
Ha. And if I go up, am I in the same spot? Yes, yes I am. Awesome, okay. I can't see a damn thing. Oh, do I have to find the three pieces? Except the fire's on now, okay. Hmm. Oh. Hi there. Come on. Oh. The only thing that I can see is just that just doesn't want to doesn't want to budge. All right, uh, let's go up and see whether anything changes. Hasn't. Hey, will you stop that? How about if I go down? at me. What am I doing wrong? So I think I've got to catch it before it lands. But... Or do I have to... Oh, that's not creepy at all. That's not creepy at all. Um, oh 
shit, what do I do? I have to go up? So then that way it's like I'm going upstairs and I can catch it before it floats down. I'm not looking up, I'm just going to keep going up. Maybe that stops it from floating down? Maybe. Maybe not. It's all right, you can stay. Just don't make too much noise. Daddy's working. What do you mean, who's that? It's Mommy. What? That's not what Mommy looks like? Well, she does to me. Hmm. Probably before. Oh. Probably uh, before her accident. Now, okay, now what? Oh. Not creepy at all. Locked? Hmm. Oh, mummy, because at least that one was less scary. Less. Less scary. Remember when I said less scary? Less scary. Oh, God. Less scary. Less scary. trying to get up, I just can't. Because he's damn... Ah, oh, right, I'm going to push it. Okay. Didn't realize I could push it. Whoa. Jesus. Okay. What the f 
fuck? Oh, Jesus. Um, I'm coming, you creepy doll. Creepy baby. Oh, Are you out shit. of your mind? What? You said there was gonna be a party. I just started a bit early. Whoop. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Uh, nothing holding that together. Ah! I'm gonna do that again. Yes. Up and up and up and come hither and disappear. Are you out of your mind? What? I said there was gonna be a party. I just started a bit early. Whoops. Uh, 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 I'm coming, I'm coming. It's gonna be perfect. It has to be. I'm gonna prove you wrong, all of you. That doesn't look like a cake anymore. What? Not, not now, Princess. Go play with your dad or your cranes. Daddy's very busy. Uh, the wolf from Little Red... Am I supposed to turn around? No. See it. Wolf from Red, Little Red Riding Hood. Oh, oh. it all better, doesn't it? It'll just magically unbreak because you didn't mean to. Go on, get out of here. Go to your room and break shit in there. Just take all your toys and smash them one by one. And keep at it. Maybe you'll finally get good at something. Wow, what a douchebag. Missing cat, Mr. Scooter, redialed. Oh my god. Oh, 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 okay. Creepy sound for no reason.
Okay, so I've got a, li a jar lid for some reason. Because apparently that's useful. here anything up here anything up here maybe it's supposed to be the clock maybe I'm supposed to get the gear It's the only reasonable thing I can think of, considering. Oh, for fuck's sake. <sighs> oh, it's a happy family. Third time's a try. Third time's a charm. Yeah. Oh, okay. You're sick. You're insane. Come on, You're Katie. not thinking straight. You're right. Oh. I am sick. Okay. I'm sick of you not being there for us. We need you. I need okay. you. What was the last time you slept with me? <laughs> Christ, when was the last time you even touched me? Do you know what that does to me? To, to know that my own husband is disgusted with me. Well, excuse me if I've been too busy working my ass off and trying to provide for this family. But no, you're right. It's much more important to whisper sweet nothings in your ear. You call that work? No. You, you lock yourself in there for hours, days. You you come out looking like shit, stinking of oh. booze and stale piss. What? Oh, that, that's all right, honey. Something got into mommy's eye. That's all. You be a good little girl and go to sleep. Daddy's working, so we can't disturb him. Mommy has to go downstairs and take a bath. I love you. More than a wife, she was mm. first and foremost his muse. Her beauty and talent drove him. After the accident, she became a burden. A disgusting monster screeching out from her bed. An anchor weighing him down. Okay. So we're getting somewhere. This door will be locked, I know it will be. Oh, wait, no. So this is... They're all different pictures of her. Not bad pictures, to be honest. Well, doesn't look like there's anything in there, though. 
Alright, I mean, I guess it's my room. Yep. All right, young lady. Shall we continue? Oh. oh. Right. Whatever happens, okay. just keep looking at me and listen. Now, okay. where was no it? Pressure. Ah, yes. The princess was all alone. In the okay. Dark. And yet, she felt that the evil I'm just witch keep looking was at him. nearby. As her eyes adjusted to the darkness, she saw something moving in the corner of her eye. And yet, she did not nope. dare to move. Nope. For she knew that that would be the end of her. The princess heard a fearsome growl. The witch had unleashed her familiar, the hellhound. Oh, oh there's no, no, no. Keep looking. Its perky ears wary of even the slightest sound. The princess mm, remained mm, motionless. Mm, 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 letting mm, the monster not, pass. Keep looking, keep looking. There was a stillness in the air. The princess breathed a sigh of relief. For a moment, it seemed like the worst was behind her. This want me to look and, and get distracted. That it was not over. But there was still danger nearby, waiting for her slightest move. Frozen in terror, she kept looking straight ahead. Suddenly, she heard a terrifying cackle. It was the... Uh. It was the evil witch herself. The wretched thing despised beauty and innocence, mm -hmm. for she had neither. The hand was near just outside of you but our heroine didn't dare to look she had to keep her head straight nope. not looking lest she be cursed by the witch's nope. foul magic she could almost feel the chilling touch of the witch's hand at her neck she felt oh, to run away, but fought it with all her will for she knew that was precisely what the witch would have wanted and then, it's moving the uh, like my that, mouse, by the way. The chill was gone. She saw a glimmer of light over the horizon. The sun was almost upon her. It was almost dawn. It was almost over. And uh, there, the princess stood triumphant in the sun, smiling as she. Wait, that's not right. Her face. Why is what? she still scared? Oh, God. I didn't what? mean to... Princess, I am so sorry. It's not that he was cruel. It's just that, to him, reality was just a pale reflection of art. He was blind to the world, unless it was translated to him through a canvas. Hmm. Oh. Okay. I'm just going to go down into the studio first and put the pictures up. Because I know it's calling me to that room, so I'm just going to, uh... Alrighty, I guess this is coming to the end, I presume. And then, depending on, I guess, the choices I made throughout, will show me. <sighs> I don't know what I expected to find. Oh. A farewell note? A final will? What I found was an apology. Expressed in the only language he ever truly knew. At that moment, I could finally see my father for what he was. A man driven insane with sadness and guilt. Trapped in this house. A nightmarish echo chamber of past mistakes and tragedies.
It was this house. A place beyond hope, beyond redemption. I knew what I had to do. Burn it all down. I had given up trying to understand my father a long time ago. Finally, forgive him. That door was glitching out, but I don't think that was normal. Hey, princess. What have you got there? Oh, that's so lovely, sweetie. But... Why pink? Mm -mm. Hmm. And there I was thinking that that was the good ending. Which it sort of was, maybe? I don't know. Oh. So that was Lady of Fear Inheritance DLC. That was that was not too bad actually. I was half expecting another um jump scare or two, but that was quite that was quite it was different. It was different. It took the similarness similarity of the, of the Laser Fear base game where it's just like, you know, creepy doors and all that kind of stuff. But it kinda changed it a little bit so that like when you had the flashbacks and you had the fisheye lens and the low angle kind of distorted the environment around you a little bit and it made you scared of things that you wouldn't normally be scared of or maybe not scared but maybe just put on edge i guess so yeah so there's probably multiple endings of that um maybe i'll play through maybe not i'm not gonna i'm not gonna promise you guys anything but yeah so that was laser fear inheritance so if you like this video, please hit the like button below. If you want to subscribe to some more Game Jump material, please hit the subscribe button. If you want to watch the uh, Laser Fear DLC, uh, not the DLC, but just the regular um, playthrough, there'll be a link at the end of this video, and it's also one in the description. So until next time, this is Game Jump, signing out. <laughs>